everybody, and welcome to another episode of TFC HQ presented by Kia. Marie Papadakis here with Gareth Wheeler. And Gareth, we are here at Real Sports Bar and Grill where the TFC season launch just happened. Everyone was in great spirits today. What stood out? Uh, a lot other than the delicious breakfast. <laughs> Front and center of the MLS Cup and behind us was a nice touch for the first time at a season launch event. But plenty standing out. Of course, the new all-white kit. Simple to the point, but you got that one little addition, the star over the heart signifying the MLS Cup championship win. You had President Bill Manning declaring that he expects basically sell out crowds for the entire season. 25,000 season ticket holders. Just the support for this club in, continues to be incredible. And we got a little bit of news within the team as well as General Manager uh, Tim Bezvichenko declared Toss St. Rick it's fully fit. He's been medically cleared after dealing with a thyroid abnormality. So there are plenty of topics discussed from broadcast to stadium infrastructure to fan experience, but overall all, you're right, this was front and center today. Many fans had a chance to ask Bill and Tim some questions, so for more, let's hear from them. I think the moment when we thought we had qualified for Champions, Champions League in 2016 when we won the Canadian Championship was the moment when we started thinking about how are we going to put ourselves in the best position to win Champions League. I said this before, we are as equipped as any MLS team ever to win this competition. There's so much for us to play for, you know, CONCACAF obviously, um, you know, we had a great season. How do we become a great franchise of all time? How do we go on to multiple MLS Cups? So today at Real Sports, it was all about the fans and at BMO, all about the team as they're in full action training for Tuesday's match. Absolutely. Uh, Tim Bezbachenko declared the team fully fit heading into the new season. That's great. Bill Manning declared that this is the MLS team that has the best chance to win the CONCACAF Champions League. And what I really liked about what was said, at least down here today, is we might see the first competitive match from Gregory Vanderveel come Tuesday night in Colorado and Bez was adamant that bringing in any big name player like Vanderbilt to the side that he'd be fully committed to winning the club and the city and that's exactly what the player is so everything seems to be trending and in a very good spot heading into the first competitive matchup of the year and of course let's throw it over to BMO training ground see what happened after training today you know this Tuesday we have a very important game in Colorado with the return leg a week later to you know I feel like we didn't really skip a beat uh, in the preseason uh, with with the core group being back and with the same coaching staff and 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 mentality uh, it's it's very important just adding another addition I think like I said about Greg I think again he's a consummate professional um, somebody who's had a lot of experience in a lot of big games so he won't be phased by any moment uh, if anything it's it's about confirming what we were able to accomplish last year we started the dialogue about a lot of things maybe the best team ever we start a lot of these dialogues but uh, for me it's just the start of that February 20th marks the CONCACAF Champions League first it's here, game it's it's here. <laughs> in Colorado you can catch it live on DSN with kickoffs at for 10 p.m.